Hello darlings, happy Tuesday to all of you and welcome to Let's Build the World. That was very romantic, that one there. Hello, welcome back to part two of the Chateau Baptiste. Whistling once again because my chipped tooth found the bottom there, look. I don't know why I'm saying that. Let's move on. Anyway, we are going to be cracking on with more exterior work today. We are going to make a start on the pool house, I think. I think we're going to try and go for a nice vibe in the pool house. I'm trying to squeeze it in somewhere. I don't know how we're going to do this, but we're going to give it a go. Yes, we are indeed. A few little changes from last time. I will point them out to you in just a second. Yes, I will. Um, but other than that, I've got nothing else to say. So let's flop on over and start building. Well, here we are, darlings. Back at the Chateau just what I have done from last time I'm going to try and point out what I've done I've moved the trees because we want to put a little car port here I think a little car park area yes we do um I have also added on an extension at the back here well not an extension but this roof area in here I'm gonna do uh, this is gonna be like Betsy's like studio where she does where she gets her ideas she paints, she gets creative up here. It's her space where she makes her collections and whatnot. Um, so we're going to make that apparent up here. And what else did I do? Did I do anything else? I removed a couple of windows. Oh, I removed this window from over this side. So I'm going to have to put a plant or something there to cover that gap. Main reasons being with the kitchen. The kitchen just didn't have any side on it. And I like and what I mean, like I couldn't put like the counters up against these windows and stuff. Very fuming. So what I've had to do is get rid of that window. So we've got space here for counters. And then I think I'm going to do like an island on this side, maybe. As you can see, we've picked wallpapers and um, flooring. This is going to be a very exclusive looking house. I know I keep saying that, but it is it's very exclusive in here. So, but I still want to pop in some contemporary brighter colored furniture and stuff to go on this very neutral gray and white palette. I think that would look really cool in here. So I do want to mix it up with a bit more of contemporary furniture and stuff in here. That's what we're going to do. Might be a bit hard because um, I won't be using custom content, but I'm going to try. I am going to try. So this is where I put the stairs anyway. I put This was the only place that this would work and still look semi-okay. So you kind of come up into this area. It's obviously got the landing here. So I had to shorten down the master suite, which is quite good because it was a quite big master suite, to be honest with you. I still might do an ensuite in the master bedroom. I'm unsure as of yet. Um, so that's where we've done it. That is where we've put it. And then obviously we've got Augustus's room here as well. But we're not going to be onto the interiors today. I just thought I would show you what I've done from last time. The lighting on this lot is fucking ugly. I absolutely hate the house and all the lighting. So it's going to be so hard to get a decent thumbnail for any of the builds that I'm doing. Because the lighting just comes from the back of the build. And I hate that. Why can't they have just made all of the lots have lighting from the front, for goodness sake? I know it's not realistic, but this is The Sims, you know? So that's where we're going. Yes, we are indeed. How are you all doing? Hello. Welcome. Tuesday is upon us, my loves. People in the UK are going back to work. So good luck with all of that, my friends. Like a lot of my friends have like started back at work today. So I know how daunting it's going to be after another lockdown, Um, after living it myself. So... I'm sending so much love to you people. You guys are the OGs and I absolutely adore you. Um, you're gonna be, you're gonna, it's gonna be fine. Now, I really wanna do that there. It may mean I'm gonna have to move, I'm doing the pool house by the way. <laughs> I'm gonna map in where we're putting the pool house first before I do anything more. Um, and then I'm gonna move you back. Oh, that's fine, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it will fit in there. Okay, well, let's get a pool. Oh, do I need to get? The actual house mapped down first. Let's try that. Let's go here. Oh, Christ. Where am I going? There we go. And then to there. And then to there. Yes. With a glass roof. I might try and make it kind of look semi-art deco vibes. Where's the roof gone from there? Why has my roof disappeared from there? I'll tell you why, Aiden. Because fucking Sims. That's why, darling. Um. Oh, my chair. My elusive chair that I ordered months ago. I know you're all on tender hooks about hearing this news. And I can only apologise for it. Um, yeah, the chair is on its way. It should be here on Thursday. 
um, they did say that's an estimate. But it should be here this Thursday. So I'm going to have a new office chair. Thank God, because you know how much I hate this one. You know how much I hate it. So I cannot wait for this chair to come and save me. Come and save me from this very, very awkward... Um, yes. <laughs> don't, don't know where I'm going with that. So we'll just leave it there. <laughs> we'll, just, we'll just leave it there. Okay, this is going to be a very small pool area. I would love this to be a bit wider, but we're just going to have to work with what we've got, my loves. Um, I'm doing these little shower rooms there, I think. And I think what I'm going to do is start the pool to there. And it's maybe just, it's a very small pool. It's a very small pool, but it's a pool nonetheless, you know? Maybe I could make it slightly bigger. I don't really want to, but I think I'm going to need to. Um, and with a too wide bit at the the top and the bottom it doesn't really matter about this gap here i would like that a bit wider but we can't be fussy no we cannot indeed yes okay yeah i think that would be and then this can be like a nice garden area over this side um do i want to raise this up and have like a little platform outside it i think i do i think i absolutely do do we want to go a little bit higher than that the thing is this is going to be very glass so i don't want people to be able to peek in to be honest with you I might not do glass on this side. That could solve that problem. Um, so we're going to do that. Anyway, moving on. I think we need to fit in line with what we've got already. And we have used curved pieces. So I'm thinking about maybe doing another little curved piece at the front here. And then the same on this side too. Yes, indeed, diddly, diddly, Joe. What? It's, it's just, why? Why are you in a work? Do I need to do that? Why? Invalid rounded room. Oh, Sims, please just fucking do one. Seriously. <laughs> do one. Invalid rounded room, my ass. There we are. I'll give you invalid rounded room. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the kind of vibe. Of the, yeah, it's done. <laughs> the pool house is done. It's not done. Don't be daft. I'm doing a glass roof on this as well. But I don't know whether I want the whole thing to be glass. Um... And I don't know what shape I wanted it. I was kind of feeling like a semicircle moment, like going for like a little bit of an art deco vibe. Um, I think I might need to do this off camera just so I can test a few things first. So testicles, give me five minutes and I'll be right back. Well, it would be two seconds for you. I tried a couple of things and it just was not working. It, the, it just looked too big next to this and it started making the build look really cramped and ugly. So we're going to have an outdoor pool, but I'm going to try and make it as private as possible because I don't want people peeking through the hedges and staring at their pasties Why? while they are in the swimming pool. That would not be a good look. It really, really wouldn't. So we're going to we're, we're gonna stick with this kind of vibe. Yes, we are indeed. I don't know if to use this down here as well. Oh, that does look nice. That does look nice. And I'm thinking I might be able to hedge around... The actual, to add some privacy. Oh, this could look cute. This could look cute. For added privacy moments, you know? So I think I'm going to do it, darling. So let me see this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's the vibe. But I need to break this up somehow. And I'm thinking about maybe using some of the topiary bushes. Just to give this a bit of shape, a bit of pizzazz. And I'm kind of feeling it. Let me see how private this would be. I mean, nobody's going to come wandering up to the gate too much. But I will be putting hedges and stuff here anyway. So they can't see over this bit. We're gonna, it's all about the vibes. That's all it is. And you know my thoughts and vibes. You really do. So that's what we're going to do today. Yes, we are. Um, will you match in? Oh, God, the colour. Oh, that one's not too bad, actually. I thought the brown one was going to be the worst one. But it's actually the best. Oh, okay. Oh, maybe I should go for a bit more of like a child looking vibe. Oh, yes. Oh, that's a bit more like it, darling. Yes, we'll do that. And then I'm going to put in that lovely fresh looking water. Yes, I'm for it. Yes, I like it. Okay, so let's get those topiary brushes out. Here we go around the topiary bush, topiary bush. I'm making this up. Here we go around the topiary bush on a Monday morning. Don't do that. <laughs> just just stop it, Aiden, for goodness sake. You're on the internet. <laughs> like I give a shit if I'm on the internet or not. I've got past that now, darlings. Yes, I have. Why? 
Oh, it's because of the hedge. Well, maybe we could just hope Rebo shop that then. Here we go, Rand. <laughs> I won't um I won't do that to you again. Why can't intersect obstructions? Oh, you are a boob. Right, come here. Get off. Get off you. You I'm gonna do a bigger one there. Let me see this. This might work then. Yeah, it does. Because of the hedge in front of it. Okay, right, that's not too bad. Let's get that same stone and pop it underneath those stairs. They're stunning. Oh, yes. Do you know what? Actually, that will be good because it now will allow me to be able to use these beautiful pieces here just to tie it in a little bit more with the actual house itself. Yes, it may um, limit my topiary bus usage, but what I'll do is just not that. <laughs> Definitely not that. I'll put them near it. Let me see the you. Let me see. Show me what you're working with, Charlie. And then I can make a decision. Oh, I'm for it. Yes. Yes, I do like that. Okay. Still one draw on these stairs just yet, but I'm going to keep them as they are for the minute because I just cannot be asked <laughs> to fuss around with them. <sighs> right. Get rid of you. Oh, not the corner, please, please. Please. The corner piece. Um, I'm going to flop these to there as well. And then bring those stairs over here too. Um, maybe it's the colour of the stairs. Maybe we, if we go slightly darker with it, maybe that would look better. Oh, they do. Yes, that's better. I don't know if I want to do that on the house though. Because the house is quite white leading up. Let me test. Let me just test it. Oh, actually, that's quite nice. Yeah, I do like that. Yes. Okay, well, we've got a basic shape of the pool down now. I'm not going to concentrate on the pool. Um, I want to get more things in, more things invited to the Chateau Baptiste. Um, so that's what we're going to do. And the, what I mean by that is I need to get a carport or a car park area in. And I also need to connect the paths with this. And also, I may change the stone here now I'm looking at it, though, just to match in with the path that we're going to be using, which is a variation of that, really. And I thought I was going to hate the pink with the grey and white. Well, not pink, but it's like that, that bricky colour. I thought I was going to hate it because of this. I really wanted that to be on here, so it kind of connects it in. But, um, but I actually don't. I don't think I like it up there, though. I think I'll keep the stone up there. It's fine. It's fine. Anyway, let's get a carport in, my darlings. So the, I might need to go a bit bigger with the square here. So I'm going to do a full one there. Can we get you in under there? Thank you. Oh, that might have been a bit too far across. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, God's sake. <laughs> it's nothing. It's not bad, Aiden. You just got rid of a bit of terrain paint. You don't have to shit yourself, love. Right, and I'm going to bring you all the way to there. I would reckon they have, would have a collection of cars. So maybe like two or three cars. Um, I wish we had some. I wish we just had cars in The Sims, to be honest with you. Yeah, that would that would um, help, especially some old fashioned looking cars. I'd love to see that. Oh, I would. I would love to see it. I think we're going to have to stick with the square vibe here. Um, hopefully that's not going to cut into that tree too much there. No, it's not. Are you on a grid, though? Let's put you up to the grid because we're going to do a little fence moment in front of it as well. And I may use these down here. Yeah, I think I will. I think that would make it look extra bougie. I'm going to do it. I fucking am. You watch me, Charlix watch me i'm gonna do it <laughs> um and then what i'm gonna do here is flop this all the way along all the way along to there and then i'm going to do a little oh do i want to make that a bit wider not this per se but like like this moment a moment like this you could say in the words of kenny clarkson and leona lewis we could do a moment like this and everything would be all right in the world. Um, <laughs> I I don't hate it. I don't actually hate it. I thought I was going to je test, but I actually don't. So I think I'm going to stick with that, and I'm going to flop you underneath of here as well. Um, all the way along to there and here as well. I will go under the hedge with some earth to make it the vibe oh do you know what i need to do there though i need to round this off so it marries in with that shape of the foundation um i kind of like that let me see that 
Yeah, I don't hate it. I don't hate it. And that's always the pull. Do you hate it? No, I don't. But I do want to make this private. So I did want to put an extra gate here, really. Um, the only problem with that being is I think the other gate that we've got that matches okay in with this. Oh, you could work. And you're a two wide. I don't hate that. So I think I'm just going to... It's like a that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to... I'm going to do this. Can I pop you to there? Let me see that. It's not going to make sense, really, it being... No, we won't do that. Get... Be gone. Thank you. All the way to there. There. And there. Which now means that I probably do need to connect this into there, to be honest with you. So I might have to do some earth underneath of these hedges as well. What is... What, why are you rising up and down for, darling? I just want you there. Just there. Thank you. There. There's added privacy. Even though I am going to do a fence... <laughs> That is completely see-through. Um, but we're not going to let that come between us. I mean, that's added privacy. It's as private as you're going to get. And not many people are going to come up this drive because I reckon they've got security teams in this place as well. Security teams looking after them. So I'm going to do it. Um, Yeah, okay. Right, so this isn't going to be balanced on each side, but I don't really mind that. Do I want to do these down the bottom here? I think I do. I do think I do. Um, yes. And then I'm going to bring that hedge over here. Put the hedge across from there to there. Do another one of those little gate moments on this side too. So we have got a little moment where we could walk down that way. I'm for that, really am. That's all going to be soil. I will probably connect the hedge in there. Stunning. Um, and this is all going to be soil too. So... This is not going to balance, look balanced on this side with the other side, but it's fine. We're all going to be okay. I think it might like nice having a bit of asymmetry with this build, considering it's very symmetrical. And I might have to move these bushes now over to this corner, but that's still going to give me the vibe that I want, isn't it? Yes, it is. Oh. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, I do like that. I do. Yes, I'm for it. Okay. Right, what I want down here is the green hedge of dreams, not the hedge hedge of dreams, this hedge, the starter hedge. And I was thinking of, about doing a moment in front of the build itself or the house itself, like all the way across here, a very trimmed hedge. We do love a trimmed bush. I don't love a, a bald, like a, a bald moment. I'm very much into trimmed though. Just letting you know, darlings, you know. The more you know, the more you know. The more you know, you, the more you can get to know someone. <laughs> Especially their bush preferences. Aiden, it's time to stop. <laughs> it really is. It's very much time to stop. <laughs> um, I don't like the repetitive nature of that. So what I'm going to do... Oh, Christ. From there... Um, we need to get the grid on down here. Shh, where, where is the grid? Thank you. Um, I think I need to open it out. Is that balanced? No, it needs to come off one more there. Yes. Yeah, I'm okay with that. And then putting in maybe a floral number. Zidane, we've used these quite a bit through Willow Creek as well. I think this would look quite handsome in a way. Is that supposed to be white? It is. I think we're going to use the white one. Um, and then I'll do another one there. Let me see. E uh. <laughs> um, I think so. I think what I need to do now, though, now that I've done that, I think I'm, what I'm going to do is put one either side here. I'll put soil underneath of it as well. Yes, yes, yeah, that's going to work. That's why it was bugging me then for some reason. Oh, you bastard. Of course you're poking through. Right, I just need to meander them a little bit more. Forwards like this. Stunning. Yeah, oh Christ. Get down to the level you're working with, Aiden. Then show me what you're working with. Right, around there. And I think I need to connect them in this side as well. Sorry, I'm swinging this camera around like nobody's business. And I think I need to go down here as well. 
da 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 again adding a little bit more um privacy <laughs> even though the hedge is smaller than the fence but we're not gonna let that come between us no we're not round to here a lot of you guys had a good idea as well with the nanny about maybe um maybe getting one of the mums to move in whether that was betsy's or giovanni's i'm unsure i'm unsure about that i do like that idea but i don't think i want another family member in here i think i'm going to make a nanny i think i'm going to make a nanny who lives in this i know you can hire them um but i would like one that actually lives in this space as well uh i don't know where i'm gonna pop her to sleep though or him it could be him um because we've got no room and I literally just thought about that as I was saying nanny. So I think what I might have to do is hire one in and maybe give them a makeover. Can you do that? Maybe we could do that. Yes, that's nice, isn't it? I do like that. Yes, that's looking very much more elite and I'm for it. Okay, let's get a couple of cars out. So transportation and I need my live edit on. They need to be quite bougie looking cars. I mean, we could get a yacht. Oh, we could very very big um so let me pick out a couple of cars okay i think these two this rather executive looking car i don't know what that car is supposed to be i'm not really familiar with american cars and this one here which i'm also not that familiar with either um so i reckon this is betsy's and that one's giovanni's and what i did do what i did do is popped a news um what would you call them a news van <laughs> that's what they're called now um and i've moved it with a tool mod just stationed outside the house just in case they want to get any scoops on these celebrities that live around this area i'm very much for that idea so we're going to go for that yes we are yes we are indeed okay so bit of terrain painting now i need to get some of this earth <laughs> i need to get some of this earth down the bottom here and I'm going to, oh, I think I need to go smaller, actually, because this isn't brick here. Um, this isn't um, tiles. So if I was to make a mistake, it would be tra a travesty. So we're going to put lots of these. Lots of this, sorry. Lots of this soil down here. And I don't think I'm going to go too heavy with the flowers. I may do. Just to make it look extra bougie. But I do want to get some statues out here as well. Very, very bougie numbers. Yes, we do. Um, this lot would be perfect with some peacocks, <laughs> but we don't have peacocks in the game, so we can't do that. We can't do that, sadly. That was a great idea, and it's wasted. Wasted, yes it is. Right, all the way along to there. And... Oh, do I want to lawn that? I think I might want to lawn that, actually, so I'm going to delete what I've done. Or what I've done. And I think what I'm going to do is do the earth round here. Like this. Now this is a lot harsher than what I normally use. Um, the terrain paint up. But it's fine. It's fine as long as you can get a good shape in it. Yes. Round to there as well. And then I'll just do some subtle lawn marks going through. Um, Hopefully. Oh. Why was that? Loads of swatches on that then. Did you just see that? That was weird. Um, and then I'm going to lawn this area in just by using a darker tone. Very, very Bob Rossing it today. Very much am. Um, all the way down to here. Lovely. And then we'll do another little moment here. Can I get in three? I don't think so. I think I'll probably get in two. Um, no bother. No bother at all. Oh, I might be able to do the start of a three there. Um, and I reckon the hot gardener comes here as well. Does a bit of does a bit of um, gardening work on all the celebrity homes. Oh, he's a busy boy. He is a busy boy. But um, yeah, I'm for it. I am absolutely for it. And then I'll just cut off that harsh line with this terrain paint here. And that just softens it nicely. Yeah, no, that's cute. That's cute. Do I want to do the same there? Or should I just brick that whole area in? I think I'm going to brick that in, actually. Now I'm looking at it just for a little bit more um, asymmetricness. <laughs> it's asymmetry. 
asymmetry agent. <laughs> but I will go underneath these and put some earth underneath of these bad boys here, Joe. Just so it looks like they're growing not out of brick, because I can't bear that. Not a vibe that we're here for, I'm afraid. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. And then the same on this side as well. All the way along, darling. All the way along you go. Let's get the harshness up a little bit. Um, all you Twitchers as well. I'm live tonight at 7pm GMT. We are playing Call of the Sea because I missed it on Friday. Um, so yeah, this is the start of my new Twitch schedule. So every Tuesday, Wednesdays and Thursdays, 7pm GMT. That's all I have to say. Because it probably gets a little bit annoying for you guys that can't come along to the Twitch um, streams. Okay. Yep. Happy with that. Let's do a little bit of softness around there as well, darling. Lovely. Yeah, that starts a nice moment going off there. We definitely need a statue of some kind there. This could probably fit a fountain on now. Now I'm thinking about it. So let me see if I can find... Oh, what am I doing? Let me see if I can find a small enough fountain. Um, They're all quite large, aren't they? That's a bit too big there. I mean, you're the perfect size, but you're, the colour's just not right on that. Oh, there we go. That's the perfect one. And I'm going to pop it right in the center. There. Oh, for that. Very much for that. Yeah, I like that um, swatch as well. Okay, there's still more detailing to do around here, but I just want to get the bare bones of the back garden in as well. That's what I'm going to go ahead and do. I'm thinking about making this all that pink uh, looking brownish brick and then i think i'm going to do a nice lawn here with a pathway maybe winding through no i want to keep it more straight i think i'll come back to that okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to stop mapping in this area now i just had to go for a wee loves i was bursting absolutely bursting you didn't even know a thing you did not know you did not know that i went for a wee then and now you do you know the, the content on this channel i mean <laughs> we're all here for it to be honest my wee talk and whatnot <laughs> oh right i'm gonna do you all the way along to there i don't think i'm gonna do a windy path now i'm thinking about it on this side but i'm gonna try and stick the pathway as close as i can to the foundation reasons being i would like a little bit of a lawn here so I'm going to bring it there. But maybe I should move the fence over to that side. Because then that could be the hope halfway moment there. This is very roughly done in the minute. We'll perfect it in a sec. Or I could keep that there. But just bring this here like that. That could be a vibe. Let me see that. Get the grid off. Yeah. As soon as I've like um, terrain painted this as well. I think that would be nice. Oh look at that. That's a bit messy there but we'll get to that we'll get to that i've also changed the color of the by the pool that this bit here um i just think that looks better i think it looks better so we're gonna start doing some more changes to the pool area now i think this area would be great for maybe sunbathing and stuff with like a parasol like down here i think that would be nice i don't necessarily want to do a barbecue area for this garden i don't think it's right for the house so i'm not going to but i will do some outdoor dining space so maybe like a nice dining table here which is, oh, I got rid of that door on the kitchen. I forgot about that. Hmm. Oh, that's not the kitchen. Oh, no, I did here. I got rid of the door there to give me more space. So maybe I should do the dining area on this side just because there's an exit there. It's all the vibes. This is going to be a nice conservatory with seating space anyway. Um. Yeah, okay, right. Anyway, as we were doing, we were doing the pool. So I do want the pool to be quite bougie. I think I'm going to use some dark blue tiles all throughout it. Or maybe I should do lighter on the bottom so I can do some pool lines. That could be a vibe. Um, what about if I went for like a white at the bottom then? I don't really normally do that with pools, but that looks quite nice, doesn't it? Oh, I'm for it. And then I'm going to do some of these. Those. <gasps> or should we do one of those like deco pieces at the bottom? Because we've got them from Spa Day. And, oh, these. I can't really see them, to be honest. What other colours you come in? Pink gold. No, that's not the vibe. I was thinking more like that. Let me see that. 
I'm not really a fan of that, to be honest. <laughs> oh, that's the vibe. We're going for Versace. Versace goodness, I think. Yes, we'll probably have to use a couple of these. So if I can pop one there. Pop one there. And maybe do like a little motif in the middle. I could make my own motif. I could do something maybe. Let me see this. Let me get in the water for a start. Um, No, I just want to grab this. I want to grab this, not the fucking pool. Why is it not letting me grab it? Right, go to hell. Go to hell. Go to... Go to hell. I can't think of what else to say apart from go to hell. Go to hell indeed. That's not going to work. Because they're going to glitch out and look weird. So maybe I could do something with these instead. Which is what I was originally going to use. But I will have to place them by hand. Um, I don't know. I don't know if they're going to be the vibe. No, they're not. No. Give me one sec. There we go. That's what I've done. Um, just size one down in the middle and then put that motif in white. I just think that looks very nice. Should I do like a border in here as well? That could look cute in white. Well, it's not. Oh, it is white. Maybe I could do that as well. Let's let's do it for science, loves. Let's see what this will look like. Um, I'll pop you in this corner here, darling. Let's not get... Why is that making all of that disappear? Oh, I suppose they all are. It's getting rid of the thicker edge. Um... Okay, and then just doing the normal square. There it is. All the way down. I don't know if this is going to look okay. And it's probably a little bit of detail. That doesn't need to be there, but it makes me happy. And that's all that matters. And it doesn't fit. That's just yeah, just the way it's going to be. I'm just going to overlap that. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. You can't really tell. Well, you kind of can, but... We, we, shh, shh. Yeah, stunning. And then all the way along here as well. I'll probably do all this and get, look at it and be like, oh, that looks awful. But it's staying now. It's taken me two minutes to do this. So it's staying. Right, you there. And then you're going to have to overlap slightly there. And then we'll do the same as what we did at the top, which was that vibe, that vibe, and that vibe. Is that closer, that one? Yeah, it is. Why are you like this? Why? Uh, I can't grab the smaller one. Ah, oh, Sims. Oh, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. Oh, come here. Submission. Right, you there. And then you there. Let me see that from above. Oh, that looks cute. Yeah, we'll go for that. Yeah, I'm for it. Okay. Yeah, happy with that. So, where do I want to do... It would probably make sense to have a ladder at both ends. Um, So, I'm going to do that. I think I'll do them in, like, a white as well. Should I do them in white? Yes, we'll do them in white. One there and then one there. Now, I would love to put some kind of like topiary down these sides, but I do want the Sims to be able to walk along here, so I'm not going to do that. Maybe I could add them near to the corners and we can use some smaller versions like here and not even necessarily the corners, just like there and there. Yes, I'm for that vibe. I really am. We're going to do that and I'm going to face you that way. Let me see you. Oh, I'm for it. Yes, I'm absolutely... I'm here for it. Really am. Absolutely 100%. They're a bit too big down there, but they would work down here. Um, And sticking with a lighter vibe as well. I could put one either side there. A bit closer than that one. There we go. Oh, they're facing the same way. Can't have that. Um, Can't really do it there because there's no space to... But that's the kind of vibe I like. Yes, I'm here for that vibe. I am absolutely here for it. So this is going to be like a little sun lounging area. So let's get let's make that apparent while we're here as well. So the exterior is probably going to go on for a few parts. Um, just want to make sure that I'm getting all of those details in, darlings. So why am I in there? Let me go and find some sun loungers. Okay, darlings, here we are. I've lifted up a platform. I think this would look nice on a platform. So what I'm going to do is flop it on the platform. I think I'm going to do just two of them. Because there is only two of them that would use this, to be honest with you. And I quite like the vibe of it being up on a platform. That platform edge has got to change. I did put a pergola over this in the beginning, but it just didn't look nice. So we, I got rid. I got rid, loves. I wasn't, I wasn't vibing with it. 
it wasn't for me um let's try and match him what we've got there there we go and then i'll use this same one here maybe let me see that <laughs> oh i don't know i may actually go for the pink instead uh i think it's the foundation that's doing stuff to me that i don't like the platform and, and when you eye drop platforms and stuff like why does it take you to this no results found but it obviously fucking is there because I can see it and I can eye drop it. So what is that about? Sims team. Again. Sort your shit out. <laughs> I've had it. I've had it with you. Oh, it was the colour. It was the colour that was throwing me. Okay. Yep, I'm for it. Right. A parasol. And I think the nice parasol. Jumble parasol and clutter. This one here. The boob. It does look like a tit. It really does. Oh, I need a cough. One sec. Okay. Cough has been had. Yes, it has indeed. Um, and whenever I choke on something, I always sneeze afterwards. It's a weird thing I've got. With, I'm not going to go into that. But it's just a weird thing that I've got whenever I choke on something. Filth. Um, I have to cough afterwards. My sister's like that as well. My sister is very strangely like that too. Very, very weird. I don't know what that is. Um, but it comes in handy. It <laughs> comes in very handy. <laughs> Coughing on a dick. I said I wasn't going to be rude. And yet I was. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. What am I like? Right. One either side here. I think that would be nice. With a nice lantern on that as well. Not going to do anything in the middle there. I kind of like that vibe how it is. Although I would maybe want to put like a bamboo, a bamboo rug down here. Um, I don't know why. I just had that sudden inclination in my head to have like a little bamboo rug like maybe not in this color obviously but let me see this vibe yeah not there though maybe just in the middle oh do you know what i'm for that not in that vibe though but more of a sandy tone oh i'm for it yes yes you can be invited you're here you're here darling and then maybe some bougie lamps either side here so let me find some Okay, a couple of lanterns I've put down there. So they have got some lighting. I'm still going to do some lighting around here once we've put um, the soil around this area uh, and put some landscaping in there. So we do get some more lighting. Same with the pool as well. I still haven't lit the pool lot. But I think what we'll do to leave today is try and find a nice dining table that I can put outdoors um, for an outdoor eating space. Now, I would want it to be kind of semi-bougie. I'm dying to use some custom content, but we're not going to. We're not. We're not going to do it. But I do want the table to look like it could be an outdoor table. Um, oh, this is quite nice, actually. I mean, it's quite contemporary. But I do want to use contemporary furniture in this house mixed with some lovely classic stuff as well. I think I'm going to go for that. Should I use the matching chairs with it as well? Um, let me have a think. The answer is yes. Yes, we will. I think I'll put up some uh, candles on here. And I think actually using those, these pieces here would look lovely. Just for a bit of extra bouginess. And maybe with some of those table decorations as well. Constantly got a table decorated this house. Um, so I think I'm going to do that. Um, is that the same way? Nope, that's a different way. Um, and I'll face you that way as well. Oh, I'm for it. And then some of those table decorations. What, what do you look like? You look very Christmassy. That's what you look like, darling. Uh, maybe we've just... Oh, yes. With some leaves and white candles. Oh, they'd be all about that. They really would. Kind of want to do like an awning over here. Um, do I? I don't know. We'll come back to that. We'll come back to that uh, next week. Anyway. Um, I know that this table isn't going to go on this side. But I think for screenshot, I really want a picture of the pool area. So I'm going to put it there for the meantime. And then we'll move it back there. Just so it looks nice for the screenshot. It's all about dressing the screenshots. It really is. Okay. Well, we've managed to do a bit more today. We've managed to get the front areas semi-complete. I still want to do some landscaping here and there. Um, we haven't done the lawn area or anything yet. So we'll do that next week too. So next week, we'll probably finish off the rest of the exterior. I might do some things off of camera. 
and then we'll move on to the interiors next week as well my loves yes we will indeed there we go you beautiful souls we are all done for today um as i said we'll be back next week with this we'll do some more let's build the world as for tomorrow it's going to be all about the potter project we've got two episodes of the potter project coming potter project coming on the wednesday and the thursday and then a design me devon on the friday so yes i think we'll concentrate more on let's build the worlds next week rather than the potter project so there might be more let's build the worlds parts next week than the potter project but um i'm just trying to mix things up a little bit for the channel itself but anyway i'm going to leave you now and i will see you tomorrow goodbye